Hey tennis fans, I'm Grace Carter and this is Tennis Now presented by Tennis Express. Tennis Express, order today and it ships today. The Davis Cup final has a new look and it has a new home. Looks like Madrid is going to be hosting the transformed Davis Cup finals coming up in 2019 and 2020 according to the ITF. The iconic Madrid Magic Box, which hosts the Clay Court Madrid Masters, is going to stage the 2019 Davis Cup Final. The most radical change in the 118-year history of the Davis Cup presents a World Cup-style final, and that is set for November 18th through the 24th. In 2020, either the Magic Box or Madrid's Zinc Center will host the week-long final. The ITF issued the draw for the Davis Cup Finals qualifier round, and that's going to be set for February 1st and 2nd next year. And here's a look. Each qualifying tie will consist of four singles and one doubles match. All matches best of three sets rather than the traditional best of five. The 12 winning nations from qualifying will join the four 2018 semifinalists, which are France, Croatia, Spain, and the USA, as well as wildcard recipients, Argentina and Great Britain, in the finals next year. The 12 losing nations will be relegated to zonal competition. ITF President David Haggerty says the new format is going to elevate Davis Cup to the status of a fifth Grand Slam. The ITF says the 25-year, $3 billion deal that it signed with Cosmos is going to create a new player prize fund of $20 million elevating Davis Cup to Grand Slam prize money levels. Now, last time we told you Davis Cup could be challenged by both Labor Cup and the ATP's relaunched World Team Cup amid a crowded calendar. President Haggerty told BBC Sport the ITF is negotiating with the ATP to run one team event the best that they can. He says they think Davis Cup, with its 118-year history, has a great reason to be that event. And he says by working together with the ATP and tennis, why wouldn't it be? The ITF president says that Cosmos has already paid the ITF $18 million and will invest a total of $80 million annually in Davis Cup. So the question is, will the new Davis Cup format draw the top stars that the Labor Cup draws? What do you think? And that's it for this time. I'm Grace Carter. We'll see you next time here on Tennis Now.